So last time we looked at how a screen reader or a program like JAWS would, would benefit someone who has a visual impairment and how that would give them access to the site. This time we're going to look at it in, in, in another way around and how someone who maybe just uses the voice for a variety of reasons. It may that they, they may have motor neurons disease, they may have uh, a, maybe a motor difficulty, and for that reason they can't access the keyboard or the mouse in the standard way. And maybe the only way they can use the voice is by controlling the computer by using voice recognition, a program such as Dragon Naturally Speaking. Now my version is version 7, so it's quite old just now. The, the newer ones are much more intuitive, version 9.5. So it's so give you an indication of how good the, the site is because we, we should be able to navigate it around quite easily. So the first thing I'm going to do is tell the computer or tell the voice recognition to wake up and then we'll, we'll see how we get on by using different techniques to, to navigate around the site. Wake up. Wake up. Page down. Page up. Commercial courses. Page down. Page up. News and events. Events. Two. Page down. Page up. Home. OK, so you can see it's, it's fairly receptive to my voice and I'm able to get around the site without any difficulties. Um, the next thing I'm going to use is something called mouse grid, so it's where I can actually pinpoint something uh, and then use that to navigate. Now, the reason why I can use it on this particular site is because links and there's a lot of spaces, things have been well laid out. So I'm going to navigate down to uh, your journey through the college using something called mouse grid. So I'm going to wake it up use the command mouse grid and you can see how I can get to, to bits and pieces on the site quite quickly. Wake up. Mouse grid. Seven. Two. Eight. Mouse click. Page down. Page up. Move mouse up. Faster. Much faster. Stop. Move page down. Move mouse down. Move mouse down. Mouse grid. Four. Four. Nine. Nine. Mouse, mouse click. Mouse click. Go to sleep. So there I used a combination of techniques of using the mouse down where I can't physically use a mouse but I can use my, my, my voice to navigate a mouse and a command called uh, mouse grid where I can identify specific locations, get to the location and click. And really because the links have been well laid out, there's lots of spaces between them and there's not too much clutter, lots of nice space and it's easy to navigate around.